Hi, this is Taylor with Rentals in SF, and this is a video tour of 81 Colton Street. Okay, fantastic. This is located in the mid-market neighborhood just south of Market Street. Super convenient location with a walk score of 98, transit score of 100, and a bike score of 98. Uh, walking distance to Hayes Valley, lots of food and drink shopping and boutique restaurants there. Rainbow Grocery is a 12 minute walk and so is the uh, Whole Foods, just 12 minutes walk away. Okay, uh, Trader Joe's, Nordstrom Rack and lots of bars and restaurants is one mile away but only five minutes to the Van Ness Metro Station. And if you need to get to the bar, it's only a 12 minute walk. So very, very great numbers. Now listen, there is a five building development with New Park coming to mid-market. Here are a few renderings of what that's gonna look like. Very beautiful, all new construction buildings. There's Market Street, how it's gonna fit in. Here is the park, which is gonna be directly across the street from this apartment. Now, right now, everything's under construction. So I just want you to be aware of that. We're recording this video uh, July 2020. Here is the front of the building. We've got uh, four units, two up, two down. Uh, this one's gonna be downstairs on the right, one Colton. Now look, right across the street is where that gorgeous park is gonna go. But in the meantime, we're gonna have construction and there's gonna be noise. So I just want you to be aware of that. Now we did reduce the price and we're offering a move-in special, so to compensate for that. And, um, okay. Okay, let's go ahead and step on in here. We'll use this door. And here's our unit directly in front of us, 81 Colton, right there on the right. But let's just swivel up, just take a look what the corridor looks like. Very nice. Okay, let's step inside. You're gonna notice that it has a beautiful hardwood bamboo floors. There is a uh, central heater with a thermostat. That's a forced air gas heater. This is the uh, first bedroom. This is the larger of the two. This is front facing with a double hung window. Uh, newer style, double pane. That's gonna help with the, uh, the noise and the heat retention. Tall ceilings, uh, closet. Long hallway. Keep in mind, uh, this apartment still has yet to be cleaned and uh, painted. Here is the second bedroom. It's a little bit smaller than the first one. All dimensions are on the website. Please check that out. By the way, this room is not going to get as much natural light as the front room, so just an FYI. Okay, here is the bathroom. I have a tub shower combination, a new light fixture going in, and a pedestal sink. Okay, this is the kitchen slash living room. It's a little on the cozy side, just an FYI. If you're gonna be using both rooms as bedrooms, then this, you'll need to be a little creative about your uh, living space here, but the kitchen is absolutely fantastic. I've got a solid surface countertop, dishwasher, double undermount sink, uh, bougainvillea in the windows, so the double hung windows right there, a microwave, and a top mount fridge, bottom mount freezer. Really quite nice. I love those. Okay, but let's just take a look at that living room one more time. Dimensions are on the website, but a little on the cozy side if you're going to fit a table, a sofa, a television, those kind of things. By the way, there's additional uh, room out here, a little storage room out here. And downstairs, I actually have a very large storage closet um, room for you. So it's uh, quite nice, quite deep. I'd say about uh, six feet by five feet by, I'd say... You're going to be, this is the room, you'll be able to hold a lot of stuff in here. So that's fantastic. Also, just to let you know, on this downstairs level, we've got a coin operated washer and dryer. And I'll show you that right now. So uh, this is the laundry room. Great. Keep in mind, there's only four units in the building, so I don't think you're going to have to wait for washer dryers too often. Um, and then trash recycling and compost is down that hallway. There is a little bit of outdoor space if you so need it. 
you need to plant something or just need to step outside. This is kind of a, just a little small alleyway here in the back, completely uh, surrounded by uh, fencing. Okay, and this hallway actually just takes you right back to the front of the building. There was two doors there, and it's basically we've gone full circle from where we began our tour. Okay, thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to meeting you at the showing.